The title of this writing is a question. What are you ignoring? This was something I wrote six years ago. I was food shopping over the weekend and was witness to a scene I've seen countless times. But this time it posed a question. What are you ignoring? I saw a man in his 50s wheeling around oxygen containers behind him with an air hose in his nose. I have no idea what brought him to that point, but I had an educated guess. He smoked the elasticity out of his lungs and couldn't breathe on his own. Got me curious about his backstory. How did he arrive at this point? And how often did he ignore what caring and concerned people were telling him? I wasn't going to ask because, frankly, it was none of my business. But it got me in the business of asking myself, what am I ignoring? Whose concern counsel am I poo-pooing? What piece of wisdom am I too above it all to come down to earth and take a hard look at? I got some answers, and so will you. One of those answers for me was, they all can't be wrong. What piece of wisdom have people, too many to count, been offering to you? I'm highly suggesting that we take that collective counsel to heart and recognize the time is now to make a new start. It's no mystery what people have been telling you. You have all the clues. Now it's time to get one. Today may be your last chance to heed their advice before you become a victim of your own vice. Let me end this on a bright note. I have a holiday wish for us all. Wrap up all your wisdom that you've received and give it to yourself. It will be the gift of a lifetime. All the best, John.